Come on, come on. Pump, 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 pump. There you go. Hey guys, it's Monday today. Fresh new week. Feels good to be home after the vacation I had to Vegas and LA. It's nice to finally be back home, get everything back on track. For the first few days when I got back, it was just, everything was really hectic. I had to go back to work, straight to work, and it's just really hard getting back into routine when you're off for so long, the time difference and everything. But finally, everything's back on track. I also started my monthly cycle Saturday, so it was kind of like a whole off week because you guys, if you've been following me, you know that when it's that time of the month for me, I'm... It's completely different. It's a different Jasmine than when she's like regular every every day kind of girl. Usually more down, don't really have motivation. A lot harder for me to stay on track with certain things. So the whole week was just kind of off, but now I'm finally getting back into the groove, getting back on my normal routine and it feels really, really good. Sorry about the mess behind me, you guys. I've been literally trying to do as much laundry as I can. You guys know when you travel and you come back, unpacking is like the worst thing ever. So uh, just been doing that today. Met up with my mom earlier today, had some breakfast with her. It's always nice having breakfast with her. And just gonna clean today, that's the plan, you guys. I was supposed to train this morning, my client canceled on me. I'm gonna train another one of my clients, two more of my clients later today, and then get in my workout. So, I feel like there's so much I wanna talk to you guys about because I was so long, I was gone for so long on my channel that I haven't really had a chance to talk to you guys all. So I will do that when I sit down and, and get a chance to talk to you guys. Talk to you guys a little bit more on that later today. I just kinda of want you to see what I'm looking like right now. So this is what I'm looking like, you guys. My mom asked me, she's like, how did you grow your butt so big? Your butt's never been that big. And you guys, when I grow my glutes, everything else grows. So like my thighs grow, my quads grow, like cause I just get fattier <laughs> everywhere else, which is nice, but it, I feel like if my hamstrings wouldn't hold so much fat and cellulite, my glutes would look bigger, but hey, you get what you get. So I'm happy with my physique right now, you guys. I don't have abs. I don't feel like I'm fat either. 
I would always like to be a little leaner, but with vacationing and traveling and all that, it's just really hard to stay on track with macro. So unless you're like there for a while and you know you can get them in and, and do everything right, but when you're traveling for a few days back and forth, it's, it's kind of hard. So this week I'm going to try to pick up things. I'm going to try getting back into my routine, uh, counting my macros again. As far as my plan goes, I think I'm going to lean out a little bit, which means I'm going to be doing a little bit more cardio just to get the tummy down a little bit, lose a little bit of the water weight, and just feel a little bit more comfortable. I haven't really weighed myself. I really don't want to weigh myself, you guys. This off season, whatever you may call it, I really want to just focus on me feeling better, being happy with my body, being healthy, and me looking at the scale every day is not going to help me with that. So that's what I'm up to right now, you guys. That's what my current plans are. I do want to create more muscle, but I don't really want to bulk too much because with my modeling, you guys, and my photography, if I bulk, I tend to look a little bit more chunkier and thicker in my pictures, which is fine when you're living a life like that, but with photography, it's just really hard because I feel it in my pictures. You can see that I'm not comfortable in my own body, so... I just like to kind of maintain, if not lean out a little bit, so that I feel more comfortable in my picture. So this is what I look like right now, you guys. Just a little, little, just little physique update for you guys of what I'm looking like. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? Do you like the bone daddy got you? Huh? Do you like it? His little nose. You know, you're Mexican when you like to have these in the house. We had some last night. So you guys, you know that I try to track my things during the week the most that I can. But on the weekends, you guys, I love to have a good time. I love to eat food. That's what I love to do. And so Chris and I just, we don't go crazy, but if there's something that we want, we usually have it. And I had not, like, I don't remember the last time I had chips, like Cheetos or Doritos or something like that. And last night I told Chris, I was like, hey, I really want some um, Doritos with some, like, Valentina and Limon. He's like, have a hot Cheetos. So we had hot Cheetos, you guys. So I love hot Cheetos with some Valentina and some Limon. But anyways... I really wanted to take the time to show you guys what I got at TJ Maxx today. So I love TJ Maxx. That's where I usually shop. Usually there maybe like once a week. Candles, everything, notebooks, everything. I love going to TJ Maxx and buying things. So I got a couple things right now with my mom. So I'm going to show them to you guys. First thing, I got these Velour lashes, you guys. Most of if you girls, if you know this brand is like... If you've seen it at Sephora, these lashes are like 20 bucks, 15 to 20 bucks. So I found these for $4, $4, you guys. So I was like, oh, I'm going to try them. And I had been wanting to try the lashes. It's oh, it's because there's tape on it that are like kind of spread apart because um, it'll allow your eye to look bigger. So I wanted to get some so I can try them. I'll show them to you guys once I try them on. I'll probably wear them today, to be honest. So when I do my makeup, I'll try them on and show them to you to see how they look. I also got an eyelash curler. I'm not really big on like buying expensive eyelash curlers. I just buy one whenever like I feel like I need a new one and I needed one already. So I just got one. This one was $3.99. Not bad. So, and it came along with this eyelash tool thing. Then I got this sea spray sea salt, which is like a mist that you put for like when you want wavy hair. This was $5.99. I know a lot of girls when they want wavy hair, they tend to like make their own with like sea salt. So I was like, hey, I'm gonna buy this. So when I want wavy hair, I'll let you guys know how that works out. I also bought this detoxifying body wash. I had been wanting a charcoal body wash because especially like after the gym, I break out on my back, like if I don't shower right away, so does Chris. So we're gonna try this out and hopefully it helps with his breakouts. We need something to help him with his breakouts. So comment below if there's anything that you use that you feel like has helped you a lot with like back knee, any kind of face acne, because honestly, I would appreciate that a lot. I don't tend to break out a lot, but he does. Then I got these leggings. You girls know that anytime I have like any like leggings that aren't from a specific brand, it's because I get them at TJ Maxx for like, this one was seven bucks, you guys. I really liked it because it was gray. I don't really have um, gray leggings, so I really like this one. So I went ahead and got it. 
Then I got this little flannel uh, shirt. I liked it because this material is like soft from the inside and during the fall it's just like is really nice because I don't have to worry about putting a jacket over it. I'm like good with this because sometimes here in the fall it doesn't get that cold. So you'll wear something like this and it's good enough and you're good to go for the day. This one was $16.99 so not bad you guys. Then I also, last thing I got was this lint roller. I have one but I wanted to get a pet one because this guy over here has shed a lot on my bed and I hate it. I absolutely hate having pet hair on my bed. I can't stand it. So hopefully this will work and it'll take off his little hairs because honestly my house cannot stay clean because this guy has his toys everywhere or is shedding everywhere. Right, Betty? Right? <laughs> so that's what I got, you guys. I spent a total like $45 on this, which is not too bad. Hopefully, I'm happy with all the products that I use, like this, the sea salt, the sea salt spray, um, and these lashes. So I'll let you guys know what these look like and if this helps. But like I said, please comment below if you have any tips on what to do, any like natural remedies for back acne or face acne that you feel like has helped you a lot. So I just got done training some clients. About to head to the gym, you guys, but Told you I would show you what the lashes look like. This is what they look like right now. Thanks, babe. They look good. I, I, I'm happy with them, but to be honest, I would not pay the regular price for these lashes. I would not pay $15 for them, but they look all right. They look okay for the gym, I guess. This is the gym outfit for today. The pants I bought at TJ Maxx. This shirt I got it at TJ Maxx like a couple of months back, and yeah. So we're gonna go. I'm gonna work out some back and buys. This guy. Let's go. Come here. Army likes the yogurt. Don't you, buddy? It's uh, all over your sir, face. Sir, you got something on your chin. <laughs> You're so cute, bumpkin. <laughs> Okay hey guys, so we are back home from the gym. I did a little bit of glutes, a little bit of biceps. I was feeling really, really tired when I got to the gym, like with a headache and low energy. So it's my fault, you guys, because when I get home, stuck cleaning, I don't eat my meals if I'm supposed to eat so or drink my water. So I was really dehydrated and I just didn't feel good. So I sat down, got a protein bar, chilled for like 20 minutes, and then I started my workout. Ended up being an okay workout. Could have done a little better, but tomorrow will be a better day. We're here cooking up some steak. We got some steak on sale. For me and Chris, it's like, yay! We get tired of the same old chicken, and when we get steak, it's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. So we're cooking it up, and we're making some chicken for lunch tomorrow. And I got some bonus eggs, protein, some broccoli. Let's go with our steak. And some corn, broccoli, corn, and steak for dinner tonight. So that's, that's what we're gonna eat. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment, and like you guys. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.